Compare clocks. The clocks show three things Madison did Wednesday evening. Which did Madison do last? Let's circle the important keyword, which did Madison do last? So let's look at the things she did and what time she did it. On Wednesday evening, the first thing she did was 7 o'clock. This is the first thing she did. She played violin. And at 7.30, she walked her dog. And at 8, she played games. Which did Madison do last? So I need to find the thing she did last. It's this one. She played game at 8 o'clock. That's right. The clocks show three things William did Thursday evening. Which did William do last? So this is the important keyword, which did William do last? Let's see, what time did he play soccer? He played soccer at 9.30. And he did his homework at 7.30, so it's earlier than 9.30, and he ate at 6. That means he ate first, and then at 7.30, he did his homework, and at 9.30, he played soccer. Which did William do last? It's this one. He played soccer. Super! The clock shows three things Caitlin did Tuesday evening. Which did Caitlin do last? She studied math at 5. She studied science at 7.30. She studied history at 8.30. So math is the earliest one. At 7.30, she did science. At 8.30, she did history. And this is the important keyword. Which did Caitlin do last? So number three. She studied history. Let's click history. Super! The clocks show three things Brayden did Wednesday evening. Which did Brayden do last? So I need to find the thing that he did last. He played game at 6. He played violin at 6.30. He walked his dog at 7.30. So he played game first. And at 6.30, he played violin. And at 7.30, he walked his dog. That means Brayden walked his dog last. That's right. The clock show three things Gavin did Tuesday evening. Which did Gavin do first? Let's circle the keyword, and this time we need to find what Gavin did first. At 8, he studied math. At 6, he studied science. And at 7, he studied history. That means he did science, then history, and then math. Which did Gavin do first? Science. Let's click. Awesome! The clock shows three things Gabriel did Wednesday evening. Which did Gabriel do first? Do first. He played games at 8. 
He played violin at 5.30 and he walked his dog at 9.30. So he played violin first and then played game at 8. And after that, at 9.30, he walked his dog. Which did Gabriel do first? He played violin. Let's click violin. Nice work. The clock show three things Addison did Tuesday evening. Which did Addison do first? Which one did she do first? She did math at 7.30, science at 7, and history at 6. So, 1, 7, science, and then math at 7.30. Now, which did Addison do first? She studied history first at 6 o'clock. Nice work! The clock show three things Natalie did Monday evening. Which did Natalie do first? Which one did she do first? At 5.30, she made a phone call. At 5, she fed fish. And at 9.30, she played. That means she fed fish. And then at 5.30, she made a phone call and then she played. So she fed fish first. Great job! The clock shows three things Anthony did Thursday evening. Which did Anthony do first? Which did Anthony do first? At 8.30 he did his homework, at 8 he read, at 7.30 he ate. So this is what he did and then at 8 he read and at 8.30 he did his homework. That means this is the correct answer. He ate first. So let's choose eat. That's right. The clocks show three things Zachary did Monday evening. Which did Zachary do first? Do first. At 9.30, he made a phone call. At 9, he fed fish. And at 6.30, he played. That means he played first. And then he fed his fish at 9 and he made a phone call. Which one did he do first? He played first. Let's click play. That's right. Great job. 